Hello viewers, I am Maitli. In 11th Max, Sets, Relations and Functions, like exercise 1.1 of 5th sum, we will talk about this video. Question is, justify the trueness of the statement. So, if this is correct, we will talk about this video. An element of a set can never be a subset of itself. So, one element of a set can be a subset of itself. So, we can talk about this in general. We can talk about this in general. Let's take an example. Now, A equal to 1 and 2. If we take a set, then it's easy. So, what is the subset of A? 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 Then there is a subset and then there is a null set. There is 1, 2, 1, 2 and then there is a null set. Sorry. Now, what do you think? An element of a set can never be a subset of itself. Now, 1 is one element. A is one element, 1 is one element, 2 is two. If you look at the subset, that is one element. One is one element. That is one element. That is one element. That is one element. That is one element. So, now what do you think? An element of a set can never be a subset of itself. Because that is what we have to do. It is an element of... An element can be a subset. So, it is never a subset. It is not a subset. It is not a subset. That is why, therefore, the statement is false or it is not true. What do you think? False is not true. Now, let's summon the sum. Thank you.